the job I had when I started out was inspecting things. And so I am very inquisitive and I watch a lot. Being a visual person, I know, I think it relates to the way I travel. My grandfather came over from the island of Andros, so I'm a quarter Greek. We went there five, six, seven years ago. And particularly Sandy had never really eaten Greek food much, and she just fell in love with it. And it's actually turned out to be a, a pretty good Greek cook. The other thing I really like about traveling is I, I like the local food, I like the local wine, and, and why they eat that at that time of the year and, and, and why they drink that kind of wine. We probably belong to about six or eight wine clubs, and we get a couple of cases from Stanford every year. But this year's really been travel, travel, travel. I'd always wanted to go on a Stanford travel study trip because it always seemed intriguing to me. And I wanted to go to Galapagos, and that, that was kind of on my bucket list. So these two things lined up. But the other thing that really made it nice for me is the guy who was my college roommate and his wife were able to come along. So we kind of celebrated our 50th anniversary of when we became roommates. It's just nice to go with a group of people who are really interested. They're, they're not there. I took a picture of the Eiffel Tower. I've seen it. Now, now I'm going to go. The chance to have a professor there, you have some context for what you're doing. And, and I enjoyed that. And that's one of the things I really enjoyed about this trip. But the Galapagos are amazing. It's just. Uh, that would just blew my mind. It really did. <laughs> yeah.